Welcome to your Astrology Oracle reading using the Star Codes Astro Oracles deck. And this reading is for the upcoming lunar eclipse on October 28th, 2023. And the eclipse is going to be at 5 degrees Taurus. And I pulled three cards of what the general outlook is for the eclipse. And the first card I got was Taurus Cultivate. The second card is Pisces sensitize and the third card is pluto rebirth and very appropriate that we would get our first card in taurus as taurus is where the eclipse is going to be taurus is all about stability what we value money home having everything set up properly and nurturing ourselves and our relationships the second card of pisces sensitize and we have a lot of emotions coming up we're in between the eclipses. First eclipse was October 14th on the Aries and Libra axis. And this one coming up on the 28th is on the Taurus Scorpio axis. And our middle card of Pisces, Sensitize. Pisces is emotions, intensity. It's what's hidden. So we, we've all got a lot of emotions ready to be released. As with our third card, Pluto Rebirth. Pluto is transformation. It gets rid of the old to make way for the new. And this is so appropriate for the eclipse coming up. We're all setting up our life in a new way with all these changes. And Taurus is how we have our life set up. Pisces is emotions from the past and things that need to be released so that we can make the transformation and rebuild our life. And what an appropriate reading as the best time to release emotions is actually on the full moon. A lot of things change during eclipse season. In between the eclipses is a very intense time. So this reading is for us all just to be aware of that we've got all these pent up feelings and maybe we're not even aware of them to be released and so that we can move on and set our life up as we want to. This is a great time to release these emotions at the full moon lunar eclipse and that signifies a time of change of never going back to the way things were before. This reading tells me that we're all on track and just to take note of where we've been, where we're at, and where we're going. Know that all these emotions and all these ways that we may have dealt with things in the past that are no longer serving us, that we can decide to let them go and let them go at the full moon. And with this reading, we can all just take a look at where we've been, where we're going, what we want to release, and make an intention to set the intention now to free ourselves of the past so that we can move forward better than ever. And thank you very much. Mm -hmm.